The Kanza Education and Science Park is a 152-acre site purchased by Topeka Public Schools in 2009. Buildings, facilities, and business partners at the park include the Southern Building and the Kanza Cafe, the Cotton O'Neill Medical Complex, the Westar Energy Education Station, the Westar Energy Education Center, as well as a wind turbine and prairie research area. The park has easy street access and there are tracts of land at the park that are for sale. The main entrance to the park is off of 6th Street. Just east of the entrance is the Capitol Federal Natatorium, part of Topeka Public Schools Hummer Sports Park. The Southern Building is one of the busiest places at Kanza Park. There's plenty of parking available for people who visit the Kanza Cafe. The cafe is a beautiful and relaxing place to enjoy breakfast or lunch. It is convenient for people who work at or near Kanza Park and it's a great place to meet friends. The cafe is open to the public weekdays from 6.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. A large new kitchen at the Southern Building supplies food for the Kanza Cafe, as well as six schools and the local Meals on Wheels program. Not far from the Kanza Cafe is the site of the proposed Cotton O'Neill Medical Complex. The future multi-story building will house medical offices as well as outpatient surgery services. There are plans for a possible second building at the medical complex. As a partner of Topeka Public Schools, Stormontvale Healthcare provides medical scholarships for students, as well as helping design curriculum for the school district's health career pathway. The new entrance to the Kansas Education and Science Park is off of McVicker Avenue. It will be inviting and very welcoming for visitors and employees at the park. Those driving will find themselves following a well-landscaped street with sidewalks and benches among the many trees with a wind turbine in the background. The Kansas Education and Science Park is designed to be an education destination for students and people from across Kansas and the Midwest. The newly constructed Kansa Drive will take visitors by the Westar Energy Substation, which is appropriately named the Education Station. The substation will not only generate electricity, but also serve as a learning tool for all who visit. How energy is produced and delivered to the customer will be explained in a number of signs and interactive educational activities that surround the substation. A short distance away is the Westar Energy Education Center. An historic milk barn structure will serve as the centerpiece of the energy education program at Kansa Park. Students and visitors will be able to be involved in hands-on exhibits involving energy, renewable energy, and environmental science activities. Classrooms and workstations will be available to enhance the educational experience. In addition, visitors to the Kanza Education and Science Park can visit the Prairie Research Area, considered to be the largest urban prairie in the United States. Walking trails will allow visitors an up-close look at the prairie and experimental plots that will be used for student learning. Access to the Kanza Education and Science Park and its many attractions will be easy, with Interstate 70 just a short distance away with signs along the busy highway pointing the way to the park. The Kansas Park is adjacent to Topeka Public Schools' multi-sport Hummer Sports Park, making it a special destination for visitors and a beautiful place for businesses and companies to call home. 
For more information about the Kanza Education and Science Park, contact Topeka Public Schools at 785-295-3000.